Hey guys, it's Shadow Knight Paladin, and welcome back to my channel. Today is another traditional speed paint, and this time it's my self imposed challenge that I would draw at least one drawing on my moleskin every month for the month of 2016. The goal for this was to make myself feel better about drawing on the moleskin, or not to be afraid of drawing on it and making mistakes and not creating perfect pieces on it. I think I talked about this in one of my older videos, but uh, I'll just mention it again. So I just wanted to draw because I wanted to draw. Uh, I had no particular idea in mind, I had no theme or inspiration. I just wanted to draw. And I noticed that due to Inktober eating up pretty much most of my time, I haven't really drawn anything on my personal challenge. And which is my moleskin. So I did. And I wanted something quick and easy, but I also wanted to look pretty good. So the thing that I'm doing here is one of my characters, and I made it so that it isn't as anime stylish as usual. Of course, it's still anime given it's my style, but the proportions are a bit more based off of. Uh, realistic proportions. Then again, I didn't really have a reference, so I really couldn't make it look super realistic, which I might do one of these days. Like a really, a really realistic looking piece, I'll be using a reference, and I'll be sort of copying that, uh, and stuff like that. Time-lapse really helped me with the video editing process. I think I mentioned this during Inktober that it made the files a lot smaller and it made editing so much faster because the cuts or the places where I stop or I'd rather cut out because there's too much footage can now be included because, well, it's fast and I don't need to worry about how much time and footage it takes. And also premieres, like the, pre the, video, pre the video preview on Premiere is now running on full resolution instead of like one fourth, and back then with one fourth, it still was it still was kind of choppy. So yeah, time lapse. Use it, <laughs> I think. It's a tad too fast though, so I wish it was like a 0.5 second time lapse instead of one second. So sometimes I have to slow it down so that it wasn't flying everywhere. So I'm using the Faber Castle Classic Colors, colored pencils, uh, the 24 set, or no, it's the 48 set, the watercolor pencils make 24 set. It's the 48 set. Mm, the first time I used them on the mole skin without scratching the paper, which is great. Uh, I, mm, that's all I can say actually, nothing much. Originally, I just wanted this to be black and white, or just lines, or just the hair that I said colored in a maybe skin. That's why I didn't really put too much thought into the into coloring the entire thing. But I, I might as well since it's on the most skin and I want the most skin pieces to be somewhat finished at least, if not perfect, finished. So I worked a bit towards that goal of it being finished. I tried using the baby oil technique here, which is supposed to smoothen out the colored pencil, but I think my layers were a bit too light or it wasn't thick enough for the baby oil to actually f show its full potential yet. So I might try the technique again sometime, but right now it was just kind of sketchy and I could have done better with just the cotton bud. But I'll see in another video how it turns out with thicker layers.
So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, please like or maybe subscribe. I usually draw some fan art, um, character designing, just art in general. And follow me on Tumblr, Instagram, and DeviantArt. And I'll see you around.